what is up guys welcome to the big unbox where we do that small tech and today i am back with another big unboxing for you for the samsung galaxy s10 e and today we're back with the official case from samsung this is gonna be the silicone series to unbox do a quick review as always throw up the link in the video description now in terms of pricing it's gonna be one of the cheapest ones you can get that's an official case from Samsung that doesn't mean it's gonna be cheap it's gonna be 29 bucks comes in quite a few different color options I went with the white so let's go and check this one out presentation is the usual Samsung or at least updated packaging that they've released for the s10 lineup got some s10 or Samsung branding s10 e silicone cover got that nice little reflective look I like that see that right there that's pretty slick and then pretty much on the back's going to tell you a little more details about what you're going to get this is going to be a basic silicone case so we'll check it out i'm not expecting a lot but just enough hopefully to make it a hit so let's go and pop it open and see if it's a hit for the 10 to the e bust it out like this no struggles no stress needed all right so let's go and check this out so my first impression it's got a very soft feel to it it feels very premium to the touch. Got a nice natural touch to it. You're gonna have some good grip being a silicone case. You can see the Samsung logo is kind of in a silvery color, which look should look pretty nice with that white color. I, can you guys call that white? I think this one looks really it's prism white, but honestly, I don't really see looking white at too many angles. To me, it looks kind of like baby blue. But anyways, <laughs> let's roll along with the review. So the actual case itself, we got the exposed bottom. Now the inside's got a really soft, nice material. It's going to give you some protection on the inside, and it transitions from this actual material. You can see the pattern right there, but it is very soft, and then it transitions to the bumper. That's the silicone part around the sides. It's going to give you some protection. Obviously, the fingerprint sensor right there is going to be open, so that's pretty much it. It's got some give to it. It's very lightweight. It's definitely not going to give you a lot of protection, but it should give you some basic protection, and that's what you're looking for. Let's go and pop it right in. No stress needed. Looks kind of nice. Look at that. So that white on white looks good, or white on blue, let's be honest, looks pretty good. Very clean look. It, I'm not going to lie. This adds zero bulk to the phone, so it's almost like your raw dog in the phone very lightweight can't you really tell nothing's on it so that's that's something to look at if you guys are looking for a minimalist case this may, may be the way to go camera protection really not much you can almost see how you're getting just a little bit of raised edge but just enough to cover it not too much camera protection for show so don't be expecting a lot let's check out the lip because everybody likes a fat no lip here so this is no lip coverage right here at all you got maybe a little on the top but really let's be honest not much lip coverage so if you do drop it i'd be kind of leery about hitting that screen and cracking but again this is one of those cases that you're not buying for a lot of protection you're just buying for some basic scratch protection so if it's going to mark some of those needs for you this may be the way to go volume up and down clicking responsive you can see those buttons stick out right there big speed button right there bottom part is completely exposed so easy access to the ports and then right here's the fingerprint sensor easy access to the fingerprint sensor no issues at all you can see the cutout right there they did a good job with the cutout you can see it gives you a little extra real estate to put your finger on with no struggles or stress needed so overall guys i guess the question is it gonna be a hit or miss i'm gonna say this one's actually gonna be a hit and i'll tell you why it's not as pricey as some of the other you know official ones like if you go it can go all the way up to 60 bucks for some of the official ones this is going to give you some basic protection. It's still got that Samsung logo on it. It's going to give you some nice grip and some basic draw protection. So I'm going to say it's a hit just because it does mark off a lot of what I need. In terms of overall protection, obviously it's going to miss a little bit because of the lip coverage and the open bottom. But for the most part, this one's going to be a hit. And I would, rec I would definitely recommend you know rocking this one because of the grip factor. And then obviously it doesn't add any bulk at all, which is something... I look at in a case not everybody again if you guys are looking for a heavy duty case definitely don't look at this one check out the official rugged case which is not crazy rugged but it's definitely going to give you a lot more protection than this one so if that's what you're looking for protection wise go with the official rugged case if you're looking for some minimalist coverage this is the way to go let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section is it a hit is it a miss hit the subscribe button we'll see you guys next time